I told you, teams are moving. I know KD and Kyrie is the talk of the towns right now. I get you. I feel you. I'm watching, right? I get that. But they got more ninjas moving, man. <laughs> and, boy, it's exciting, man. I'm not going to lie to you. Sometimes it's better than a game. You see it here first, ESPN popped up on me, man. I trust their news source. Well, uh, I shouldn't say that, but ESPN is telling me, you know, I was watching this flight mic guy up top. You know, he got a lot of subscribers. Like, holy shit. Anyway, flight mic, good job on the KD series. Agreeing your sentiment, but let's go to Boston. Indiana Pacers, Malcolm Brogdon, the Boston Celtics. Grab him up for Daniel Tice, Aaron Nate Smith in the 2023. I'm I'm surprised they include uh, Davidson and the kid from Alabama. I, they really ruin kids' career. I, I, I'm serious. It, it's a shame. That's that's the rookie I says a big time sleeper out of the NBA. Uh, I think he has the potential to be definitely, uh, uh you know, a third team All NBA type guy. I, I said it. I said it. I, I know players. I know talent. So. N- n- niggas can't tell me shit because I know talent. Let's go to Malcolm, Malcolm Brogdon's situation in this trade. It's very, very interesting that they were able to land. Um, look at this. Oh, my God. So, you see CBS? CBS is 15 hours ahead of ESPN. I should have never even looked at them. So, let's go through the, the stat line. What exactly is happening? All right. Oh, no. Yeah, we got to get into all this shit. Celtics receive Brogdon, okay, right? You know, this is a very nice piece for them. Adds on to Mal- Ma- Malcolm, uh, what's his name? Marcus Smart. They are maybe the top defensive team. So here we here we go. Tice, Snaysmith, Stock has made his way back up there. That's crazy. Malik Fitz, Jawan Morgan, 2023 first round. I'm not sure why they didn't ask for Davidson. I thought that was a better move, but hey, it is, it is what it is, man. The, the, the Celtics ain't sleeping. And now they got a guy who is almost an all-star. So just mind you, I understand you guys are loving these, these guys. I understand you guys are loving these guys, you know, like uh, what's his name? KD and Kyrie, and I understand. I love them too. I, love, I especially love Kyrie, the Jersey guy. I keep saying that shit. I said it for about a bazillion times. All right, but this is this is really stupid here, man. I mean, you add on Tatum and and, and Brown, and now you add this piece in there, and you really didn't give up too much, right? Nate Smith wasn't really coming around, right? Good draft pick and Ben Maturin. We don't get into his comments, man. Slow down, rookie. I, you could just see in Ben's face. He's going to be trouble. He needs a mentor to follow him around. I could just see it. Follow that man, please. I love him. I don't want him to get him in trouble. You know, I used to be young like him, and I could feel he's going to get himself in trouble. Um, Malcolm Brogdon is really, really great piece. Let's go ahead and look at the roster and see what this does. Uh, for your boys on, on 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 the Boston Celtics, I mean that's the main thing here. I'm not going to look at the other guys coming over. I mean Tice is a a beautiful a backup power forward or center, hustle man. Shout outs to him, you know. Uh, but this is really about Brogdon and how cheaply they got him for, in my opinion. Uh, let's get to the rosters. This, this is actually pretty silly. The roster is pretty stupid now. Um, you, you get to the depth chart. Let's go to the depth chart. Man, I wish I wish Davidson uh, see that kid Davidson special, and um, I, I'm going back there. He's stuck, got drafted. I hope he. I hope there's a trade. So Marcus Smart, your starter. You add in Malcolm Brogdon there. He he adds on to that trifecta. You got Brogdon, Smart, and and Pritchard. Uh, you know, uh, and I believe Smart may may move to the bench at times. I'm not gonna lie to you. I mean, I could see that happening. He is an upgrade. Brown is there, right? Nate Smith is gone. They lose a rotation player in Stauskas. Uh, but no offense, there's several people in free agency. I won't be surprised if Stauskas got waived or, 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 you know, and they're able to pick him back up. Tatum is there with Brown. Greg Williams is there. Need to sure up that small forward position, even though Greg Williams has been great. Uh, power forward. Tatum's, uh, excuse me, Horford's only getting older. 
Got to really think about that. Tice is gone. Got to shore that up, right? And then Robert Williams at the, at the center. So uh, need some help on the front line from small forward down. Need some more backups because it can't just be Brown Tatum all season. So that's what they're going to have to build up, and they can't. So it's going to be very easy to fill those gaps of free agency, and uh, they're going to immediately be able to uh, cash in some dividends. So great, great move by the Celtics. Uh, Brogdon can also play shooting guard. So really, really nice move. Uh, I'm excited for the Celtics. Really improving, and Udoka is being great as a coach. They added even more defense. So your boy step back, stepping off, man. It's getting busy. Brogdon to the Celtics. Wow.